So guys, we're just pulling into the Tesco car park now. Now the reason we're here is not to film Tesco's. Someone told me that if I carry on to the top of the car park, there's a grade two uh, listed building, which Historic England describes um, as one of the most intact remains of a late 19th century um, glass bottle production company. So we're just heading over that way now and we're going to see if we can see it. There it is, guys. Would you believe it? In a Tesco car park. It's not the sort of thing you see every day when you go shopping. Uh, so welcome back to the channel, guys. Now, you've just seen what we've come to look at today, so I just want to give you a, a quick brief history of it, just before we do get out there and get the drone up. Now, it was built, I believe, in 1886 um, by a guy called John Shaw and John and Edwin uh, Cannington, the Cannington brothers. Um, it ceased, it ceased um, production. Uh, being an active furnace in 1918. Um, after that, it was primarily used as um, locker storage, um, shower rooms uh, for the company. And then during the Second World War, it was actually used as an air raid shelter because of the, the basement below. Um, went into a state of disrepair after that in the 1970s and by 1982 um, the rest of the site was demolished and what you see before you is what they call now the number seven glass bottle shop um, and that's what remains of what was um, claimed to be the largest glass glass bottle production site in the in the world so yeah, so we'll get the drone up. I was going to get out there, but just having a look now, um, I was going to go for a bit of exploring, see, but it's all fenced off now. Um, I believe they've got funding, funding for the place now of around 25 million, uh, with the first phase of 1.3 million for stabilization and the preservation of the remains. So yeah, I think it'll be a good one. We'll keep an eye on that and just see see what goes on with it and pop back and see the progress so yeah so there's only one thing left to do so let's get out there get the drone up in the air and take a look from above take off home point updated <laughs>
So there you go guys that was the cannington show um number seven bottle shop if you did enjoy that one then please give it a thumbs up for me and don't forget to hit that subscribe button i'll see you on the next one